Hi guys. Well, up until a couple of minutes ago, it was a spectacularly gorgeous day here in the end times in paradise in St. Croix Virgin Islands on Christmas Eve, December, that'd be Thursday, December 24th, 2015. So Christmas Eve, I thought what would be fun today, your old doomsday prophet uh, and chronicler of the collapse of a planet, I'm going to do an update of that old Simon and Garfunkel shtick from, I believe it was like maybe 1967 or 1968, you know, where they played Silent Night in the background and played over Silent Night on Christmas Eve was the going through the world headlines on Christmas Eve 1967. So we're going to go on the mainstream media news here on Christmas Eve 2015 to see what the planet has learned since the late 60s and so we're just gonna go down the list here I'm gonna this is gonna be part of another rant coming up in a few minutes US Christmas lights use more energy than entire countries. Yep, I uh, don't know if that was probably true then too. Uh, so anyway, I'm going to come back to that article. Let's just go, I I'm just only going to stick to the headlines and the first few words of each story. Of course, the biggest story on the planet, deadly storms, tornadoes rip through Southland, killing one says seven, one says eight people. Okay, from the U.S. to China, ten Chinese cities issue pollution red alert. This is more than 100 million people in China have been warned to stay indoors today. Okay, from China to Reno, Nevada, earthquake on major fault line rattles Reno. Experts monitoring. Yes, from there to Sub-Saharan Africa, whale carcass closes <coughs> popular beach amid shark concerns. Mm-hmm. All right, from South Africa to Japan, and, and, and I haven't skipped over one story. I'm just going down the list. Japan court gives go-ahead for a restart of two nuclear reactors. And then another story just down the list says Japan gives go-ahead for a restart of four nuclear reactors. So however many it was, they, the court gave the go-ahead after its operator said they were safe. And uh, as, as long as we've got that going on in Japan, here in our own country, <coughs> U.S. plans to ship plutonium to New Mexico facility. All right, the U.S. government plans to designate six tons of surplus plutonium now stored in South Carolina as waste and ship it to a storage facility in New Mexico. I'm sure every terrorist on the planet uh, is looking for that route map. I'm assuming it's going by truck or train from South Carolina to do to New Mexico six tons of surplus plutonium here is World Bank loans Philippines 500 million dollars to fight natural disasters uh-huh from the Philippines to India plan to clean New Delhi's air may fizzle as auto rules eased. 
the Indian capital gasping and choking under record high air pollution announced a grand plan to clean its air, but that plan seems to be fizzling because, uh, well, we're not factoring in the millions of new automobiles clogging India's roads as all these millions and millions of Indians getting out of poverty. Yep, let's see. Here is Indonesia needs to do more than burn boats to stop illegal fishing. But I think that's a damn good start. I wish I had flagged this photo. It is a damn cool photo about Indonesia blowing up these commercial fishing boats, just bombing the sons of bitches. Uh, yes, Indonesia does need to do more, but it's a damn good start blowing up these fuckers. Okay, going back to South Africa, we see North Korean diplomat expelled for rhino horn trade. Yes. A North Korean diplomat in South Africa was expelled after he was arrested for illegal rhino horn trading. Here we go. Unusual winter has millennials concerned about climate change. All right. More about the red alerts for heavy smog in China. One dead, severed, seven injured in Mexico. Gathering fuel near pipeline tap. Oh shit, my, uh, my computer just uh, ate this. I don't know whether to go back and try to get this, start this rant over. The last story before my computer went down. Fight against palm snares New Zealand dairy farmers. This is a story about all these dairy farmers using, feeding a byproduct of the palm oil industry to, uh, to the, uh, to dairy cows, of course. I don't eat beef, but I do drink milk. Uh, anyways, I think what I'm going to do today will be a good test. I'm going to do two versions of, of my Christmas Eve uh, roundup rant. Uh, I'm going to stop this one here at uh, however many minutes and then I'm going to come back after I go back and get my the full list because I want to finish this out and do two rants. This was the short abridged version but anyway I will bring the full length version in another rant but before I do I'm going to pick up about this story on the US Christmas lights and come back at you with yet another rant for this one Merry Christmas